And now to enter this video at all. Can you stop smacking your mouth? Jesus Christ. That's my intro. We're on our first date and you're smacking your mouth. Let's go. So, hey guys, I'm joined here with Billy. Billy the goat. Let's juice yourself. Stop smacking your mouth. What the hell? Anyway, so today we're doing a first date. This is my first impression of him so far, which is. This is not your first impression of him. We usually live together. That is true. That weeks. is true. But we haven't been on a date before. This is our first date. It is our first date, isn't it? How do you feel? Bro, I'm calm, bro. You look nervous, so nervous. I'm getting a bit sweaty, actually. Well, <laughs> I'm getting a little bit flushed. I just haven't been on a date for a while. Yeah, I can tell. I don't. I can imagine. This is what I'm eating. A um, feta cheese slow roasted tomato pasta it's like salad. It's a white girl meal. It is. Feta cheese. I mean, what the hell is feta cheese? Feta cheese is feta cheese. And what's the difference between cheese and feta cheese? Where's the feta coming to? We don't even want to get into that conversation. But there's no outside. difference between her eating this and eating those, that feta cheese salad, whatever it's called. So talk then. Why are you so nervous for? Yeah. I ain't nervous, love. How's your day been? My day been. Church, man. Church, church, church. <laughs> nah, fuck this. How I didn't let me eat How that. How is it? It's good. Problem? Wait, is that actually nice? It is actually nice. It's Honest. tomato pasta. No, you know why I don't trust you, yeah? Because right. you said it was good straight away before yeah. you even finished it. Is that a bad just... thing? Yes, bro. Try it. <laughs> Fucking try it, hello? <laughs> Smart pasta with a little bit of leaves on it. So we're going to start at F then. Where are you going to start? Hashtag Killy. Yeah. What are you saying? What are you saying? What am I saying? Yeah, that's what I want to uh, You pranked called me the other day and you told me that you had a ting back home and you had to choose between her and Go me. Go check out that video, Bleed the Goat TV, subscribe. Basically, you're saying you want me to pick you over her. Oh, I did not say that. I didn't really want to say, to be honest. You panicked. I did panic. You panicked. I ain't being the other girl. What does that mean, though? You ain't being the other girl. It's so much fun, Drew. Yeah, I'll tell him you've never been a side thing. I've definitely been a side thing before. Exactly. Stop capping, bro. You, I can't lie. You are side thing material. <laughs> you're what I like to call a super sub. What the hell? If my starting player is mm -hmm. injured, yeah. yo, I'm bringing you on 90 minute plus four. Uh. Oh my god. But you know that's the best position to play. No, it's not. I promise you. Because no one wants a wife. Bro, being on the bench is the best position. Is it? It means you've got no responsibility on your shoulders. You don't want to be there as anyone star player. I do. Yeah, fair enough. Fuck. Let's talk about the fact, like, what happened. Okay, like, yeah. what happened with Killy? Why does Killy a thing? Why did it begin? Bro, from my perspective, yeah, yeah. I was minding my own business. And then one day, Killy just started being onto me. I'm thinking, right, like, Kate, like, you're pretty and that, but I can't remember doing that. It's only been 10 days. I love how you're like, it's only been 10 days. That's a bad thing, by the way. All jokes aside, what happened is this, yeah. But I've got a spiritual routine. If I'm living with people, yeah, mm -hmm. every day before I go to bed, I've got a spodgy. Yeah. I know it sounds weird, but it's, it's my routine. Don't judge me, bro. Mm -hmm. So in the locked-in house, I've spotted everyone. I've gone to spot Kate now. Someone, I think it must have been Ilias, and made a joke saying, yo, you look your butt lips. Everyone was like, oh, you know what it reminded me of, yeah? Not like when you're in primary school. Everyone's making a big deal about it. Everyone getting in a circle. Yeah, yeah. Everyone's saying, guys, kiss, kiss, kiss. That's how I felt like. Can I just say my side of the story? No, you're innocent because you was feeding into it, bro. <laughs> no, I you wasn't. Was, yes, you was, bro. My social battery died that night, so I was lying there, like, kind my of like. Social battery died. What kind of private school lingo is that? <laughs> I was in a house with the other people for 10 days. It was a fucking long time. I couldn't back myself at all because I was just you like so back dead. Up. Back it up. You didn't want to back up. What does that mean? It means whatever you said. <laughs> I didn't mean that. I didn't mean whatever you thought you thought I meant because I didn't mean that. I didn't say anything. About Grace, it. Chip, and Elias were like, we're gonna push our beds together. We're gonna make them like sleep next to each other. And I was like, what can you say at this point? If you say no, 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 it's bait. So I just kind of just let it happen, you know? Because you want it to happen. It's not mm -hmm. what I wanted it's to happen. It. You just kept making jokes saying, oh, I thought Billy was gonna sleep in my bed tonight. You were trying to manifest it. <laughs> I was trying to manifest you it. The power of the tongue. Oh sure, she literally evicted me, which is our next topic. Oh yeah. So why did you evict me? <laughs> if you found me, Michelle Mark. Now nah, I'm just being serious. Go on them. BLM. And this is the funny thing. When I say BLM, I don't mean Black Lives Matter. I mean Benny's Life Matters. If I'm being honest, there's no reason, bro. <laughs> there's no reason why I evicted you. I don't, like, bro, everyone keeps asking me why did you evict Kate. Bro, should I be so honest with you? Yeah? Mm -hmm. Bro, I looked up, I seen Kate. I seen Rachel, I seen Destiny. Three girls that I was close with in the house. Mm -hmm. Three girls that. Wait, wait, wait. You know why I just had a flashback to you? What? You just said, why would I vote you out if you like me so much? Yeah. Who the hell said that? <laughs> The way that that slipped past you so quickly. We Carry on. that like you so much. 10k yeah. likes and I'll release all the text messages we had. Release them, bro. Don't release them, don't release them. <laughs> the thing is, it's fine because I still got screen time for my eviction, so thanks mm -hmm. for that. Yeah. No, it's like. <laughs> yeah. Nah, no, no, you be learning, you be learning, so. <laughs> Me and Max taught you well. But all you've done is eat, bro. Yeah. You've been just, chatting. Just stuff in your face. This is what you do on dates. We eat. Yeah, no, but. Sometimes. Have you been on a date before? Ha ha ha, good one. Ha, no, ha, no, ha, no seriously, have Obviously, you? Obviously, I've been on a date before. Travel lodge. <laughs> <laughs> joking, I'm joking. That type of chat is definitely not, not you haven't had a first date. What date? What, what was chat? your first date then? What chat? Your chat being like, yeah, of course cool I've been on a first date. Yeah, I've been on a date. My first ever date was probably an arcade. Okay. Arcade thing. Little How's bowling that? thing. We done the flipping. You know when you put the coins in there and you play the games. Mm -hmm. Just that. It was calm, man. Okay. Calm. What was your first date? Um, I was in a bush, innit? 
I went back to the car. <gasps> yes. In a dogging spot Fiat, as well. Fiat 500. Fiat yeah. 500. Mm, no, no, no. You had like a Mercedes Benz, but it was just dad's. He insured it. Okay. It was a Wagamama's date and cinema date. Wagamama's. I got chicken katsu curry and I was fucking almost shitting myself in the cinema. Oh. He put my ar his arm around me yeah. and then I like got really like, it's quite spicy for a mm. little white girl like me, you know? What is? Chicken katsu curry. Oh, I thought was going to say putting your arm around you. <laughs> yeah, that's I'm spicy as well, too bad. <laughs> okay, so what have I got to do for it to progress? The game's the game. Bro, calm down, bro. Don't talk to me like that. What have I, <laughs> I got to do for it to progress? Oh, what has to happen for it to progress? That's what I want to know. Make me laugh. Be committed. That's hard for me. Ugh. No, make me laugh, I said. Make you laugh is hard for me. Mm. Yeah, true. I haven't been giggling at all throughout this whole thing, to be I'm honest. Not, I'm not that funny. Yeah, 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 no. Commitment, attention. I'm like a puppy. I love attention. You're like a puppy? Yeah. So you got good tongue? <laughs> Delete that. <laughs> Delete. What? What do you need for a relationship? Have you ever had a relationship? Ish. 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 And what happened? No, it is. Like, the contract wasn't officially signed. Exclusive. Yeah, basically. Mm -hmm. Personal terms were agreed. The agent fee was agreed. The medical had been completed, but the contract wasn't officially signed. Did you fall from heaven? That's already me. Did you? No, 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 I don't fall from heaven, bro. I came out my mum. <laughs> I like a jumper. I'm lying. I don't like the jumper. But let's pretend like I like it. Because that jumper is bad, by the way. Is it bad? Yeah, it's a bad jumper. So no. It looks like I threw up on you. <laughs> But let's just pretend I like a jumper. Okay. Bro. I like a jumper. Um, Say thank you, bro. Thanks. Is it hard to put on? Should I help you take it off? <laughs> <laughs> the most difficult person to live with in the lockdown house. Obviously you. <laughs> Textiles are irresistible. Now, because you're just too busy trying to mute me. 247. I literally had to avoid you for the last two days because we literally couldn't speak. Otherwise, we'd be like, oh, kitty. As much as I love him, it has to be Max, let's be honest. Really? Like, he was the best person to live with mm. and the most difficult. He was the best because of how funny he was, mm. but the most difficult because of how funny he was. There's no break with Max, bro. Just 247 continuously, you get me? Mm -hmm. But now, nah, man, I love Max, though. But he definitely was. There was times where I'm trying to sleep and Max is just not stopping. He's not showing any signs of stopping anytime. <laughs> yeah, no. That's the worst, Max. <laughs> There's, there's times where I was, I'm sleeping, yeah? yeah? I'm waking up and he's still going. Really? I'm thinking, bro. <laughs> bro. Don't do that again. Sorry. <laughs> Do you like it? Did you just giggle at me? I made him laugh. You didn't make me laugh. I, did. I smiled, I smiled. Anyway, that's no, I can't say, say bro again. Bro. I'm not road. You're not road? No, I'm just a normal guy. It was so lovely to do this with you. You know what's funny about you saying that? You know I just came out of jail yesterday. <laughs> Yeah, literally, I just came out yesterday. Oh, really? I did it for three years. Oh, really? Yeah, my thing. Yeah, I feel like you don't really have much experience with girls, though. Why not? I don't know. Are you being genuine or are you trying to draw me? No, I'm being serious. Wow, what makes you say that? <laughs> nervous, bro. It's jet me. You think I'm nervous? Mm. Bro, I come out of love from nervous because, bro, this is how I'm 247. I'm actually not nervous. I don't even argue with people anyway. Do you I not? don't argue. No, I don't argue. Do you raise your voice at all? No, I don't. Mm -mm. Have you heard me raise my voice? Except that's... when you were getting mauled by the dog. Yeah, but that was for entertainment. I wasn't even scared, man. That was for entertainment, man. You weren't scared? Nah, that's for entertainment. Are you serious? I'm being dead serious. Bro. Really? Yes. You're like, you don't scare, you don't no, scare dogs. I'm joking, of course. I'm flipping friends, dogs, bro. <laughs> flipping hate dogs, bro. See, that's Beautiful. another red flag for me. Why is that a red flag? Because I want to have dogs when I'm older. When I'm yeah, married but with not, kids. Yeah, but that's when you're married with kids. Do you know what I'm getting married right to? Now. Bro, I don't speak English, bro. <laughs> <laughs> your favourite housemate of housemates? Obviously, I knew I was going to get along with everyone in the house, innit? But like, I didn't really expect to like actually get get along with you the way I did. Because mm. really and truly, when I seen your video, I can tell you're on the... Edu educated, no, educated eating, Oxford, Cambridge, like, that's the side of the waters you're from. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. And obviously, I don't really know, I don't have no one in my friendship circle from the walk of life you're from. When I start teach UK trap and you you quick, you learn quicker than destiny, mm -hmm. when I tell you how to dance, mm -hmm. you're a terrible dancer, by the way. Thank you, you thank least, you. At least the effort was there, the passion thank was there. You, yeah. yeah, man. So I was like, rah, she's actually calm, you know. Mm -hmm. But it took me a while to realize I can't. When's the last relationship? Oh, okay. Uh, a year and a month ago. Well, why did it end? You don't know. I do. No, I'm joking. It was a three-year online relationship. We were quite online. Busy. Online. So eBay, yeah. just Skype calls every day. No. <laughs> so you, have, do you meet up in real life? Yeah. We said online dating. As in, like we were a public profile together. Well, that's different to online. Online dating is, is like Tinder and that. Oh, oh, sorry. But as like we were like YouTubers together. When was your wow. last relationship? My last relationship, 2002. <laughs> With what, your mum? Whoa. Your mum in your womb? Whoa. No? <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. It's not a bad whoa, thing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa it's not a bad whoa, thing. You're just, you're whoa, sitting whoa. in her stomach. Listen, listen. I know you're in private school. I know that's what, I know that's what they're on in private school. Yeah. They date their mums and that. I'm not on that, but I don't do that. Milfs, to be fair. No girl can ever make me nervous, ever. I don't care how lame she is. I don't care <laughs> how many followers she has. Okay. I'll never get nervous mm -hmm. in front of a girl ever in my life. I swear on your notepad. On I'll my notepad? Yeah, I swear on your notepad. I'll never get no, no, nervous in front of a girl. What was that you started? Yeah, I just got nervous. nervous. <laughs> I just got nervous. Oh, bless you. It's okay. 
bless me. I didn't sneeze on. No, I just bless you in general. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. What did your dad think of me? My you, dad. Do you know your dad? Yes, I know my dad. Oh, that's, that's just, he said it like it's obvious. I'm sorry. Some of us don't. <laughs> Would he like walk in and be like, Brexit means Brexit? Oh, oh. my God. If you brought me home to your mum, what would she say? She'd probably start laughing. <laughs> And I'm joking, if I brought you home to my mum, yeah, which is never gonna happen, mm -hmm. she'll probably just look at you and be like, hi. Literally. That's, that's it. Yeah. Do you wanna find out? That was smooth, but no. Do you have any brothers or sisters? Yeah. How I've many? Got a few still. How many? Two brothers, one sister. Dog? Cat? I'm Fish? My little, I got a little brother that comes as a pet. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> what about you? Um, I got a dog. And a stepbrother, no, stepsister. Swear it down, you yeah, you did kind of give only a child. Yeah, yeah. You were spoiled growing up, weren't yeah. you? No, 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 actually wasn't. Stop I the cat! <laughs> have you ever had to work a normal job? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, 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 because I started this when I was 18. I, I was working since I was like 14, to be fair. When what? I was 14, GameStop? I don't know if a GameStop guy to me. Mm. Show, 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 show. So my first job, yo, when I was 14, I, I, don't know, I had a paper round job. You know what a paper round is, Where you like cycle on a bike and you chuck the papers? Well, I, didn't actually, I couldn't afford a bike. I was, just, I was ride, just riding the oxygen. So you walked, yeah. then? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I walked, I walked. But yeah, so after the paper on job, yeah. What was my next job after that? So yeah, I started hustling in school, started selling, flipping, chew it, Lucas Aids, Chris. And when I tell you I had the bro, like I was bet I was competing with actual stores. <laughs> Bro, there was a shop right around the corner from my school, yeah. Mm -hmm. People could have easily gone there and got it for cheaper, but it came to me instead. And I, was really, I was that guy. I was really that, that guy. guy, yes, bro. Did you like BBM for it or what? BBM? BBM. I didn't go to school in middle, middle age like you. What do you mean? When I went to school, it was Snapchat. Yeah. BBM? Yeah, Blackberry. Blackberry messages. Yeah. Brother, no. Obviously, when I matured, I left school now. So I got a job at the cinema. I got sacked from that after three weeks. Why? You know, the probation period for the cinema was three months. I only lasted three weeks, bro. What the heck? Why? Because I didn't work, bro. I used to go there, eat popcorn, and watch films. <laughs> <laughs> what was your job? Everything you do in the cinema, I had to do it. Where's behind the till, scanning the tickets, cleaning the screens, I had to do everything. And you didn't? Nah. How did you last three weeks? I don't know, man. When's your birthday then? My birthday's 27th of July. Ah. Oh, you got, does that mean you're a Gemini? Don't even, brother, if you mention the star sign near me. Let me check. Was it 27th nah, of July? I'm a Leo, I'm a Leo. You're a Leo? Yeah. Oh, the fact you know what your star sign is. Of course I know my star sign. Don't talk about star signs, bro. What's your star sign? Capricorn. Nah, I don't care. We don't talk about star signs in front of me. Okay, fine. That's how that's, yeah. I'm just gonna see if we're compatible online. Should we see if we're compatible? <laughs> Ready? Leo and Capricorn are considered to be an incompatible zodiac match. They're just very different and will have a tough time getting a relationship off the ground. <laughs> bro, I'll be honest. Star bro, signs why the fuck are we here then? Star signs are bullshit anyway. Why are we here? Are really gonna let what Google told you destroy the energy. Bro, don't make me break your phone. <laughs> How many kids do you want? Um, probably two. I want twin boys. Twin boys? Yeah, I want my kids to be black, so. I'm just saying that I'm gonna have to do the IVF thing, innit? I'm an IVF. <laughs> The IVF? Yeah. So your industry plan? Oh uh, yeah. Probs. That's pretty, so you actually made it in a lab? Yeah. So you're an experiment? Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. You this? <laughs> wow. Well, I finished my meal. Are you so hungry? No. You're not hungry anymore? I lost my appetite looking at you, to be honest. How? Yeah, that was a good one. So you got me. You actually got me. Man. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. How do you think that went? Be honest. I don't know. I'll probably give it like a 7 out of 10. Fuck. <laughs> That's not bad. I've had right. one out of ten. So you don't want to hear about those. Not rate me. I feel like the extra three is like the violations. Your hair's messy. Is it? That was Rose. Billy, it's been a pleasure. Has it? It has. Thank you so much for coming on. I rated it a seven. He rated it a N. N. Mm. Basically N A. Yeah. Not applicable because yeah. you're not gonna rate it. Right. And yeah, the rest is history. Hashtag Killy. Make it trendy on TikTok. And then now time for the interesting part. Turn off the cameras, man. <laughs> Delete it. <laughs>